Hey everybody, how's it going? This is Matt from snoozecentral.org and snoozetv.com. Today we're going to be taking a look at X-Range all white portion. And uh, this one is kind of interesting, so stick around. You might like it, you might not. You're just going to have to pick up a can or two to try it and see what you think. All right, guys, so flavor profile on General X-Range All White is kind of interesting. Now, when I first heard about this snus or this All White tobacco-free option, I was intrigued because I was thinking to myself, self, is this going to taste like tobacco but uh, an All White portion? And uh, I was excited about that. I really was. I was expecting really a lot out of this snus. And... As you guys know with all whites, you kind of got to walk a line there of expecting a lot and really lowering expectations. You have to kind of meet it in the middle. And with this snus in particular, it kind of honestly, to me at least, it was kind of disappointing. Now it's not to say that uh, don't try this snus. I mean, there's something out there for everybody and taste is very, you know, personal. It's it's different from person to person. So some of you guys may really like this snus, others may not. And as far as an all white tobacco free option goes, that is supposed to taste like tobacco, for me personally, this one kind of fell short. Now I kind of understand where they were going with this snus because when you first pop it in, you do get like a cedar wood type flavor out of it. You get a little bit, I mean just a slight bit of uh, bergamot and an interesting odd cooling sensation in the upper lip. It's not mentholated, but it's got this weird phenolic note to it. It's kind of hard to wrap your head around. Now if you go into this thinking that, okay, I'm gonna get an awesome tobacco-like flavor in just an all-white option, you're gonna be disappointed. But if you approach this with an open mind, you might like it. It's not gonna be for everybody. I'm gonna put that out there. It's not something that everybody is going to enjoy, including myself. I didn't really find too much enjoyment out of this snus from the flavor. But I think if you have an open mind, this might be something that you would like. Um, I'm not here to say that this, again, this is the best, you know, tobacco tasting nicopod on the market. It's, it's not for me, it's not. But again, if you want something that tastes like cedar wood, if you want something that has a little bit of bergamot in it, maybe some juniper in the background, just to, you know, mix some more flavor profiles into an all white, this might be a decent option for you. Um, again, I wouldn't expect a general uh, tobacco flavor out of this. I wouldn't expect a Cronin. I wouldn't expect a Grove snus or an Eton. Nothing like that. It, it does not taste like your traditional tobacco flavor. So get that out of your head. Again, it's going to taste like cedar wood, a little bit of juniper maybe, um, you know, some bergamot characters there, and then that phenolic cooling type sensation that's not mint, it's not menthol, it's just something of its own flavor. So if you go into in, into this snooze expecting its own thing, you might be surprised. If you want something different, totally off the wall, and uh, different, it, it might be an option for you. Now nicotine-wise, it, it feels like a normal strength, and it does have two out of four dots there on the nicotine scale. And, you know, honestly, with these all whites that General produces, the nicotine is not not bad at all. I mean, it definitely comes on a little bit quicker because it's an all white option. So you're gonna have a little bit more free nicotine there. It's gonna hit a little bit harder at times than say your traditional snooze, which is good if you need that little bit of bump. And you know what, I really like the fact that these all white portions are very discreet in the upper lip. Um, there's really no form of irritation on these, which is another nice thing. If you want to be somebody that sits in like a board meeting or an office setting 
and not have to worry about uh, you know snoo strip in your upper lip this is definitely going to do that as well because again there's no tobacco in these there's no uh, staining on your teeth which is great they go in clean come out clean so that's another bonus with this X range um, tobacco free now I you know I love the slim portion format of it it's great I, I love that slim portion I, I that's probably one of my favorite uh, portions on the market is slim format so again I think if you keep an open mind to this snooze you're gonna enjoy it I really like the can design um, it's very clean uh, you have the general I don't know if you can make that out in the light there up top general is uh, there it is it's kind of like a white you know like a hidden type deal there with that Swedish match as well I don't know if you guys can make that out um, it's right up here it says Swedish match but anyway I really like the can design it's very nice and clean minimalistic um, just a really really nice can design something that uh, would definitely catch your eye very photogenic can as well but uh, yeah I think again taste is subjective everyone's gonna have different taste buds but if you walk into this with an open mind I think you may find it interesting for me something I'm probably personally never gonna pick up again but I think for the average user if you guys are gonna want something different I've said this enough in this video but it's it might be your snooze so keep an open mind when it comes to these all white portions. Some of them are really good, some of them are not as great, but worth a try. And I would lump that into that category of not that great, but something to try to keep it interesting and break up your monotonous, you know, mundane routine of snooze. So give it a shot. I'd say it's uh, it's worth a try. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching this video. And until next time, if you want to stay connected in the world of Swedish snooze, please be sure to check out none other than snoozecentral.org for the latest articles my friend Larry Waters wrote and Mo Unz in his drunken stupor of a world. Also, don't, don't forget to check out our Facebook page and uh, join the group over there for some snooze discussion. And uh, I will see you in the next video. Until next time, you know the drill. Enjoy good snooze. See you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching.